Hi everyone, you are welcome back to another interesting question. We are asked to calculate the area of the cycle that is this here. We have the size of this angle to be 60 degrees. This angle is a right angle and this is also right. The length of this side is 6 meters. So how can we solve this? How can we calculate the area of the cycle? It is very simple. The formula for calculating the area of a cycle is pi r squared. Pi is a constant while r is the radius of the cycle. We don't have its value but from here we see this angle is subtended by this code qs. Let's assume its length to be h. We know the formula for calculating the length of a code is 2r sin 1 over 2c. r is radius while c is representing the size of the central angle. We don't have it but we see this angle is subtended by this same code to the circumference. There is a rule from the circle theory that the angle at the center is twice the angle at the circumference if subtended by the same arc. So since this C is at the center and this is at the circumference, C equal to 2 times 60 degrees, which is 120 degrees. Substitute it here. 1 over 2 times 120 degrees is 60 degrees. 60 degrees is a special angle. Its sine ratio is root 3 over 2. This 2 cancels this 2 r times root 3 is root 3r so h equal to root 3r keep it aside come here since this angle pst is a right angle this triangle prs is a right angle triangle and we have the size of this angle to be 60 degrees based on the rule that the summation of angles in a triangle is 180 degrees this must be 180 degrees minus 90 degrees minus 60 degrees. 180 degrees minus 90 degrees is 90 degrees. And 90 degrees minus 60 degrees is 30 degrees. So the angle size is 30 degrees. Now come to this triangle PQT. It is also a right angle triangle. We are going to draw its median to this side. We know the median of a triangle bisect the opposite sides. Therefore, this and this are equal. So since the sum length is 6 meters, this and this each must be half 6 meters, which is 3 meters. But this side PT is also one of the sides of this triangle PST. So if we draw the median of the triangle from this vertex, it will pass through this point, which is the midpoint of line PT. Label this point A. If you look at this triangle, its median is from this vertex here, which is the vertex of the right angle. Same is for this triangle. The median is from the vertex of the right angle. There is a theorem, which I proved in a short video, that the median of a right angle triangle, if drawn from the vertex of the right angle, is exactly half the length of the hypotenuse. So since this side is the hypotenuse for both triangles the two medians will be half its length half its length is here 3 meters so the length of this median and this each will be 3 meters now look at this triangle two of its sides are congruent that makes it an isosceles triangle the angles facing the congruent sides are equal that is this angle and this. So if we let this be C, this must also be C. Okay, we know in every cycle from its center to the circumference is a radius. And here we see this line segment, this, this and this are congruent. And they both start from this point. If you assume the point is a center of a cycle, and this is the radius. Throughout the cycle, its circumference will pass through 
this point B, this, this, and this. If you look at this angle 30 degrees and this, both are subtended by a QS, one to the center of the circle and the other to the circumference. Recall the rule we used earlier that the angle at the center is twice the angle at the circumference if subtended by the same arc. So based on that rule, since this angle at the circumference is 30 degrees, this must be 2 times 30 degrees, which is 60 degrees. If you look at this triangle, since this is 60 degrees and this and this are congruent, it will have their size to be 1 over 2 into 180 degrees minus 60 degrees, which is 60 degrees. So since all the angles of the triangle are 60 degrees each, that makes it an equilateral triangle. And here, all sides are equal in length. So since this is 3 meters and this is h, h equal to 3 meters. Come to this equation, substitute the value of h. So 3 equal to root 3r. Multiply both sides by root 3. Here root 3r times root 3 is 3r. While he 3 times root 3 is 3 root 3. This 3 cancels this 3. Hence r equal to root 3. Substitute it here. Root 3 all squared is 3. Pi times 3 is 3 pi. So area of cycle equal to 3 pi squared. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, like, share and comment. And also turn on notifications. Thank you.